What is going on guys? My name is Infinity and today I'll be taking over Zilla's channel for this video. In this video we'll be discussing the new Call of Duty 1.09 update and all the changes that came along with it. First a few bug fixes. In Special Ops they have a fix for an issue where a player would see no objective after retrying a mission after spectating the exact mission is Operation Paladin. A CDL fix for rule sets in Search and Destroy where field upgrades were disabled. Fix for an exploit where players could duplicate their kill streaks. Very overpowered up, uh, bug. A fix for the Blue V Optic Challenge not displaying the proper text description. Fix for misspelling of trophy. How does that even happen? Uh, we have some fixes for ground war. Fix the bug that could cause the filter on the respawn selection screen to stay on the screen when spawning back in. Fix for an issue where the select loadout screen would keep reappearing after already selecting a loadout and attempting to spawn back in. This was one of the most annoying glitches. Thank you, Infinity Ward. Next, we have some fixes for the challenges that we're not tracking properly. We have the following challenges have been fixed. Infiltrator, Warrior's Code, Aggression, Dominator, and Munitions. And for the Officer Rank Challenge fixes, we have Launch Destroys, Heartbreaker, Precision Airstrike, Karma, Close and Personal. And now for the part we've all been waiting to see, the Weapon Balance Changes. First, we have a buff to the AUG. Increasing Close Range Damage, Increasing Mid Range Damage, and reduced chest multiplier. Next, a big nerf to the 725. Small reduction to base weapon damage range. Significantly reduced the damage range added by attachments. Small hip spread increase. Reduced effective damage at the hip. And for the last change, a small nerf to the Model 680. A slight reduction of damage range with all range extending attachments. I think these the buff is big for the AUG because the AUG was already a decent weapon. The 725 is definitely going to be a lot worse than it was, but I think it's still going to be one of the most overpowered weapons. I think that's a good change and healthy for the game. The model, I didn't have too many problems with, but balancing shotguns is always good. Uh, if you guys have found this video helpful in any way, make sure to drop a like in this video and subscribe. Also, make sure to stick around for the gameplay in the end. It's a pretty nice gameplay with the Kilo from one of my videos. If you want to see that full video, you can go watch my best class setup video from, again, my channel link in the description. If you would like to watch my content as well, my link will be in the description of this video. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Understood. Hours. No read. <laughs> Allied UAV overhead. Help. HQ shut down. Regroup. HQ moving soon. Get ready. 9023 on station. Death from above. You're clear to engage. New HQ established. 105 ready.
HQ established. Contested. <laughs> 